forget social media this is where businesses are now growing in 2024 and around 90 percent of business owners still don't know about this platform and we just finished automating it yes i'm talking about school the most trending online community where you can get guidance and start your online business here you can reach their true potential and achieve promising growth it's a space where collaboration knowledge sharing and collective learning drives success and guess what with Alex Hormos's contributions the school is now at its peak potential in boosting businesses and if you still have not started the school yet use our link in description to claim 14 days free trail and start your journey now but to truly thrive on school your online business active engagement is the must-have key and that's where our school automation app steps in with this app you have endless possibilities like auto scheduled post that to predefined post or open AI generated post as per your school business or you can auto DM campaigns to celebrate 30 days or one month two month anniversary of members or even engage them or notify them on your weekly q and days or leases right are you excited let's dive in deep on these powerful features and remember that i'm going to give you a surprise gift at the end of this video let's go on you can see here we have developed three workflows firstly to auto schedule post specifically we are looking forward to auto schedule on Mondays and Fridays and then we have a scenario where uh, we look forward to add new members whenever they join as a paid member or trail member add them to our CRM we are using Google sheet here as a CRM and then the third scenario the workflow here we are looking forward to auto DM, uh, generate an auto DM campaign for each of the members like when they achieve 30 days in school or 60 days or uh, like we have weekly live Q and days we need to send a reminder to them one day before so we we cannot uh, send 1000 reminders or 2000 members manually right so we can automate these kind of messages so all these three scenarios are done using a platform named make if you are new to make don't worry guys use our magic link in description to get pro plan for free with 10,000 operations for a month now let's go in detail with the first workflow that is the auto schedule post so here you can see we start with an open AI brain module that is message and assistant so what is happening is we have developed an assistant in open AI you can see uh, where we given some instructions so you can see uh, we are given a name to the assistant in open ai platform and system instruction and we selected a model and you can see the instruction uh, you are a skilled content creator for a, an online community focused on ai and automation that's our school and your job is to create engaging posts for fridays and mondays and giving some uh, instructions like rules no repetition casual but professional tone encourage participation reflect the day right so we are giving this kind of instructions and we are saying that the output should be a json structure with good engaging title and content so this assistant has been set up already in our open ai platform and then in open ai module we chose message and assistant module so in message and assistant module you can see uh, like when you open this module the first part you need to set up is a connection so uh, you can follow the online help or click on add and add the connection and then we can choose the assistant so as i said we have created an assistant named school post and selected it then in role section provide the role as user and just provide a message create a post for monday or friday as per your schedule so we are planning to schedule this for monday or friday so automatically this date function that you see here uh, formatting the now now means the current date and time when you use the format date function on the now keyword what happened means when you run on monday it will automatically generate the monday keyword or if it runs on friday it will generate the friday keyword and create a complete message create a post for monday or create a post for friday so that's how it works and then yeah uh, the entire setup is same uh, you don't have to do anything further and just i'll run this and show you the output yeah okay you can see the result see here we have the title 
and we have the content ready right so the title is tuesday troubleshoot crack your ai challenges and it is giving some challenge and uh, say that uh, let's dive into these challenges and come out even stronger looking forward to seeing your post and advice below so it's creating an engagement the post is creating an engagement and now we have the school module i'll show you at the end of this video where you can get this school module it's very easy so if you go uh, in school module you can see a lot of options like watch for post create a post list post almost uh, around 20 plus actions i believe and here you can see you can use the module create a post see this create a post so just use create a post and if you open you have the option to add the connection so add the connection by clicking on add and then select your community where you are admin or where you are owner so i have selected master ai automation that's our school where we are training tons and tons of uh, blueprints and solutions to our community members you can check out uh, the seven day free trial and so we selected our community and selected the category id so under what category we need to post the uh, current auto schedule post right so here you can see announcement intros wins we have different categories and all these are like some of them are custom made and everything will be pre-populated automatically and that's the beauty and then we have to map the title and the content so once this is done let me run this and i'll show you uh, how it gets reflected uh, in our school so i'm running this so it's running the school uh, module yeah it has completed now let's go to the school cool right you can see here a tuesday tips sharing ai insight and shortcut it has created a post and then it uh, say the uh, it mentions that drop your tips tricks or questions below and let's learn from each other's experience it's creating an engagement with an it's giving a beautiful post uh, creating uh, a curiosity among the members and asking them to drop their comments and making them engage to each other right so that's the main intention of this auto schedule post and we prefer to do this uh, maybe in mondays and fridays where they leave the where they close their week or where they start their new week right to ask about their plans or what they achieved at the end of the week now let's go to the second workflow yeah so let's go to second workflow this is a second workflow where we look forward to add the new members joining our school community to the google sheet or you can use any crm you wish like monday.com salesforce airtable or any similar one yeah so we start with uh, the school watch for users module you can see here watch for users yeah and then uh, you need to select the uh, community or group name where you are admin or owner and provide a limit uh, the limit is the number of bundles to be processed per run because it follows a scheduled run so you can schedule it every to run every 50 minutes or 30 minutes or one hour according to your requirement and now you need to use the module create a chat channel so chat channel is also important so you can see there is a create a chat channel so here you need to map the user id so you can find the user id by searching here user id so you can map the user id of the member right so before i proceed further i'll show you the google sheet structure you can see we have created this google sheet where it contains headers like name join date subscription message channel id email and the amount so amount is not necessary so let's come back so this is the google sheet here what we are doing so we have the google sheet module so we have connected the add a row module of google sheet you can see and in the add a row module you can pass the name easily you can just type name and map the name of the person or if you want to put first name last name that is also possible like you can put first name or last name so here we have given the internal name and then the join date so join date we have provided uh, you can see the date is provided and the subscription type is active the message channel id that is uh, the output of the second module the school module so that we are mapping that is a channel id so you can see here channel id if i type channel you can see channel id here yeah here we are mapping the email uh, using the metadata variable so if you type metadata so you can get the metadata information or just type mpme you can find the email so map the email and then 
to get additional information like amount or other details we have to use parse json module why means it's simple so if you come back here you can see we have parse json so there is two type of metadata for email as i shown you it is mpme uh, the name that school provides but for uh, the other information like the amount they paid currency type it is stored in a metadata uh, mmbp so mmbp comes uh, in uh, like it, it doesn't come for all the members so that is why we added a router to conditions with a filtering if the metadata mmbp uh, like exist mmbp exist you can see here how it comes it comes with a curly braces with currency usd amount etc so if it exists we parse it we open the json or extract the variables using par json module you can see here par json so use a par json module and then map the metadata mmbp so just type mmbp and you can extract it and map the currency or the amount easily see here then we map the amount easily so that's why we have used par json but in other cases as i said this json is not available for all the members so that is why we provided a fallback route with an yes that is it's a fallback route opposite of the first route and we have given a google sheet module add a row without any amount information so that's how this is going to work so if we go to our google sheet I'm just going to add one data and show you how it works. Yeah, let's run this module. So it's running. See here, it's getting the information added. See here, Jahar, Fasil, and their chat ID, right? And the email is not provided and the currency is not provided for these members because these are our own members or the admin team, and hence this information is not provided in the google sheet yeah uh, or what we say the json is not available with payment because we are not paying uh, as a member yeah so that's about the second workflow now let's go to the third workflow here in this workflow as i mentioned the main aim is to send auto dm campaigns or reminders on our weekly q and a so we start with the module search rows where we list all the members in the google sheet so you can use the module here search rows from the google sheet app and then you can select the sheet here you can see uh, i have selected the member details sheet and i provided uh, some filtering where the joint date exists so we can run this module so we'll get all the details yeah so we get all the details here now what happens as i said we have two type of messages going on so in the first message where we are checking uh, like we have weekly q and a's on wednesday so we have a filtering uh, to check whether the current date uh, the date is wednesday so what we did uh, we have done the formatting function we use the format function now uh, with the format date to check whether it's wednesday or not if it is wednesday it will pass and it will send a message using send a message module of school so you can use school send a message module just search here send a message yeah so just select this and here you need to add the connection and we have the channel id the chat channel id already is generated uh, from the second workflow that we, uh, the previous workflow we explained so we th have that we have that in the google sheet as i show here you you can see the channel id here so that channel id will be mapping here and then we have the name in the google sheet yeah so we can say hi uh, say if it is jahar hi jahar just say heads up our next live weekly q and a is coming up soon so in this way we can generate thousands of dms right without manually doing or manually hiring a va to do this in the below route we are setting up a campaign uh, messages based on their joining date so for that we are using a switch module you can find under tools switch so just select switch yeah and then uh, in switch we are giving an input as date difference say i joined today or i joined last week 
so from last week to today it is seven days so that difference the difference between the now the current date time and the join date from the google sheet is calculated using this round and parse date difference function and then we get the days so based on that if it is two days we are giving a message you can see hi hope you are setting in well yeah hope you are setting in well have you checked out our ai automation hub yet it's set up with templates that are ready to be imported in one click yeah apologies for the uh, typos we have some typos here and then if it is five days you can see just wanted to make sure you are aware of some cool features in our community we have uh, dedicated uh, disc uh, discussion forums where you can ask questions share insight so in seventh day we are messaging it's been a week since you joined our community right so i hope everything is good similarly for 10 days 30 days 365 days like uh, celebrating the anniversary of their joining so in this way we can set up auto dm campaigns for our members and this will also trigger a send a message module where we map the message channel id from the google sheet and we have the content coming from the switch module so let me uh, just demonstrate that uh, for uh, say we can dm to a specific user that's maybe we can filter uh, with my own name so i'm providing here the name contains jahar so you can see the dm campaign so we need to find the difference i'm not sure how much difference uh, we are in so let me calculate the difference of my joining date using this module so then accordingly we can change the switch module for testing yeah so i'm running this module so you can see the difference of my joining is 136 days so let's put a, let's change it for demonstrating the pattern to be 136 so you can see a dm message yeah so i'm running this so let me go to my dm whether i got a message or not you can see here i have got a message from shirin hi jahar hope you are setting in well have you checked out our ai automation hub yet it's set up with templates that are ready to be imported uh, in one click so this is how we can set up auto dm campaigns for our members so is it exciting so now let me show you where you can get this cool automation app it's very simple you can navigate to our page you can go to our product section and here you can see school automation app where we have given uh, the features where we have provided the installation guidelines create an account on make uh, you, you can see the magic link here as well fill out the required details and you can start using uh, our school automation app so there you have it a powerful automation app that can make your school engagement more stronger and smarter than ever with this app you are not just saving time but elevating your business and creating deeper connections if you are ready to automate your school experience and grow your online business use the link in description and sign up for the automation app now and here is the offer the complete gift for you if you are going to start your school newly use the link in description and send an email to us so that we will provide this school automation app completely for free are you excited before you go don't forget to hit the like button and provide your valuable feedback and queries in the comment section and don't forget to subscribe our channel for similar such videos stay tuned